We hath returnest. Um, so, a couple things. Uh, in between episodes, um, I leveled up, I believe, or no, I might have done that in the last episode, but we can now use this weapon, which is going to be our go-to weapon. Um, I went and killed a couple guys over here. There was a Tree of Grace, or whatever, one that has the, t the um, allows us to get another charge on our flask, so we now have seven. Um, I went to the round table hole to level up this weapon one time, and there's a lot of different things there, and we're going to go explore that, like a lot of different things. A lot of things have changed um, now that we've killed our first um, Lord Soul, if you will. I also wanted to read something in the inventory here, very important item that we got. Might be a key item. Yes, it is. Yes, the great rune of the shard bearer Goldrick, devoid of any benediction. Seek the Divine Tower of Limgrave, which stands beyond the Great Bridge from Stormvale Castle. Right, I wanted to read that. Um, also wanted to go get my runes. Um, so let's just see how this fucking weapon goes. Oh my god, that guy just got hit on the collateral. And it fucked him up. Alright, stomp. Stomp. Also, I spoke with Fia, um, the lady that, you know, wants us to, uh, let her hold us. In her dialogue is, uh, now different. Um, but there was an option to talk in secret with her. Exile armor. Finally. I was literally just talking with this, uh, talking about this with a, a friend not too long ago. Saying how I've literally found, like, jack shit for armor. Um. That's gonna put us on a heavy load. Alright, we're sticking with our, our blue cloth vest. Yeah, I wanted to come over here and actually grab our runes, because we haven't done that yet, and we did lose quite a bit of runes. Like, a couple thou. To one of these goddamn birds. And these aren't just, like, regular birds. These are explosive birds. Of course. Motherfucker! Fucking stupid ass fucking guard attack, bro. Oh my god, it's so fucking annoying to set up. Oh my god. Of course, I have to kill this fucking big asshole again. Alright, I guess that's a really easy way to kill him, okay. Okay, well... That makes me feel better. Um... Yeah, so I mean, I just kind of lost my train of thought. But before we go back to the round table hold, like, I wanted to, like, actually come back here and... Tie up a few loose ends. We also need to pay an NPC a visit in Liernia. Because we just need one somber shard. Uh, level 3, I believe. And we can upgrade this weapon to plus 3. Where's the fucking counterattack? Excuse me? Can you not do that with this kind of weapon? Bruh.
I don't think you can. Wait, no, I'm not pressing right trigger. I'm stupid. I fucking hate these enemies, by the way. I don't know if I've said that already. I hate these things. You motherfucker, dude. Yeah, you definitely still can. Bro, I'm gonna fucking break something in a second in real life. Absolutely the worst enemies in the entire game. Hands down. Worst enemies that I've encountered so far. Like, absolutely the worst. And a floating something. Holy fuck, dude. Please, no more birds. Love birds in real life, but not in this fucking game. Smithing stone level two. Just one copy. Doesn't really look like there's much else up there. Okay, we can summon here. I mean, I gotta tell you, that jellyfish put in a lot of work. Alright, this is a gray site we've already visited. That door over there doesn't open. From that side. Yeah, there's still a lot here. Like, I want to move on to Liernia. But it seems like there is a lot here still. Okay. I normally hate this idea of, like, throwing rocks at enemies to lure them out, but... Of course it had to attract the fucking dog, too. Okay, big dude down. Looks like we're coming at these guys from behind. What? What's this? What's this? What's this? Why is that glowing like that? Oh, there are a lot of guys here. You know what? While we have a moment, kind of want to summon these dickheads. Look at this actual goon squad I've just summoned. I gotta say, having some shit like this definitely helps when you go to fight this many enemies. And there's Horatio the Hornblower. No, put that shit away. These nobles kind of go hard, I'm not going to lie. Kind of put in the work. Spike. Some magic grease. All 
All right. Fucking, there we go. Exile gauntlets. Oh, there's one guy left over here who just missed out on all of that. Bro, there had to be a guy right in front of me that I also didn't see. Okay. Oh my god, the ranged attack. Okay. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of enemies in one spot. That's just like a lot of them. Okay, I, I remember where we are now. So I've already been in there, got the painting, which I didn't look at. There's a dude up there. We came out of this door. Thought this looked like an entrance earlier. Yeah, that grafted scion is still, uh,. around fire 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 something stone sword key two chests god slayer's seal that's quite the impressive title and the Godskin Prayer Book. Okay, give to a learned cleric. Sacred Seal of the Godskin Apostles inlaid with obsidian said to represent the manipulation of Black Flame. This catalyst enhances a God Slayer incantations. No skill. Armament has no skill. The armament, on the other hand, has a skill. That skill will be used instead. That is a weapon. Interesting. We're back to full health because of our little rune we have on. Yeah, this area is kind of huge. I really want to go like to some other areas now that we've beat the main, the big bad here, if you will. But I also can't, in good conscience, leave this place behind without fully exploring it. I know I will regret that. More dickheads, dude. We need to find an- I need to find another gray spot. At least a shortcut back to one. Festering bloody finger, bro. Why is that the name? No saving your friend. Yeah, this guy's gonna fuck me up. This might as well be a boss right here. Okay. 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 
Okay, there's a ladder. Climb the fucking ladder, dude! You son of a bitch. Yeah, there's just no way I'm fighting those guys with no heals. Alright, we're gonna go this way instead of the other way. Because clearly I'm coming at everything from, like, the opposite direction. Which I don't know how is the case, but... What other path I took to get here... Like, put me behind everybody. It's not a terrible thing. That still doesn't open. I'd like to be able to open that door. You know what I kind of want to equip? kind of want to equip a sacrificial twig. Kind of get twigged up. Yeah, I don't want to go that way. I just need to run past literally the entire army of Godric. I also didn't even get this item. Holy shit! What the fuck, dude? Oh my god, the fire ballistas in this game. Wait, there's another one behind me! There's another one behind me. Oh my fucking god. Okay, alright, more goons. Oh, this area sucks, bro. High key, this area sucks. Go! Wandering dickheads! Go, ye wandering nobles. Gotta say, I'm not really a fan of how slow this weapon is. Compared to the, the scimitars we've been using. What the fuck is this? Dude, heal. It's knocking trees over and shit, and also spinning at the speed of sound. Dude, I'm 
getting stuck on like fucking stupid shit everywhere. Okay, Jesus. Jesus Christ. Beast blood, old fang, and a somber smithing stone. So now we don't need to make that trip to that NPC. Technically. Technically we don't, but I still might since we're using this weapon. I think we're gonna use this weapon. I don't know. It's really slow for being I mean it is a curved grade sword, but Nope, no 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 no. Let's go this way. Those are the enemies I don't want to come in contact with. Oh, in a sight of grace. Oh my goodness, I am happy to see that. That area is a fucking grinder, dude. Holy fuck. The somber change of music. Bolt Drake Talisman. The fuck does that do? Talisman depicting a yellow ancient dragon. Boost lightning damage negation. The ancient dragons who ruled in the prehistoric era before the Erd Tree will protect their lord as a wall of living rock, and so it is the shape of the dragon has become the symbolic of all manner of protections. Dragon, huh? I don't like this. No, 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 no. Not another one of you. Please don't be more than one. That's just all I ask. Don't be more than one. There's fucking more than... Alright, no, dude. Just no. They're just, there's just no way. Oh, they can hit each other. That one's an archer. Okay, this is not so terrible. Hey, I killed one. All of that for a smithing stone, huh? Alright, I would like to get the fuck away from you. Some just like Shadow the Colossus shit, dude, and I fucking love it, but also at the same time, fuck everything about this. Take a shot. How? Uh, 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 how did I just get hit behind the pillar? Excuse me, sir? Alright, that's, that's a little bullshit. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say. We right, got time before the other one shows up. You want that to happen to your friend, huh? See what happened? All right. Oh, Christ, dude! Oh my God! Thought I was gonna die there. I still don't want to go back and fight the one at the Divine Gate. I was like, please don't be more than one. Miyazaki said, 
Bam. What do you think this is? Is Elden Ring? There's got to be three of them at least. Literally pound me into smithereens. That ankle. And a swing and a miss. All right. Okay. And a teleporter. After all of that. I don't really want to leave Stormville. Cast Stormvale Castle yet. Bro, what is out there? What is this? A warming stone? Seems like a pretty, uh... Oh, pretty odd place to put an item. Better be a fucking good one. Wait, I have to heal nearby allies. Okay. I was going to say something about this earlier, but uh, that summoning stuff in some cases feels like easy mode. You can upgrade those, I'm pretty sure. Kind of cracked. All right, we have a teleporter here. But we also have some items down here. I hopefully I can get back up. Ah, yes, yeah, soft cotton and an ash of war scarab. All right, hopefully I can uh, mount and goat my way back up here. Hopefully, please. Don't tell me. If those big dudes respawn, I'm gonna fucking be upset. All right, we're back up. Now, does it matter on which st side you stand? Fuck it. Where's it gonna take me? I love the mystery of this. Like, this is such a weird mechanic, but I just love the mystery. Like, where where am I just gonna get teleported to? Storm Hill. Am I on the other side of that? Uh, I think I am on the other side of that bridge. Yeah, I am. Like, really far. Yeah, because we were here. And that took us all the way across to here. I see those bird enemies that back there, so I'm going to avoid them at all costs. And we're going to go ahead and open this door here. Divine Tower of Limgrave. Yo, 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 yo. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Also, I turned the auto hub off. I think I'm gonna leave it on auto again, just because this game is gorgeous. Bro, this is, this is insane. This game is insane. How high up does this fucking go? And a sight of grace. Those other divine towers, I would assume they are. Oh boy. Yo. What the fuck is this, dude?
great rune restored. Looks like some sort of corpse of something. Yeah, um... It's blessing raises all attributes. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Wait, no, no, that's not a talisman. So what do you do with the rune? This great rune is known as the anchor ring found in the center of the Elden Ring. First demigods were the Elden Lord Godfrey and his offspring, the Golden Lineage. How are you supposed to use it, though? Crystal tear forms slowly over the ages where the Ur Tree's bounty falls to the ground, can be mixed in the flask of wondrous physic. What is that? What is the flask of wondrous physic? Well, whatever it is, I don't have it. And it seems like I should. Remnants of the grafted. Sure, look at this earlier. Remnants of the grafted. God of the grafted. Hoon into the. Erd tree. The power of its namesake can be unlocked by the finger reader. Alternatively, it can be used to gain a great bounty of runes. So this is like his soul, I'm guessing. The man sought power through the grotesque act of grafting. One day we'll return together to our home, bathed in rays of gold. Alright, well I think that's uh all we need to do here. We can probably just dip. Dip, 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 skis. Where are we on the map? Okay. Oh, look at this fucking map. This is insane. Travel over to Limgrave. Hmm. How many souls do we have? Uh, 6,300. Can we level up again? I like to level up if we can, because I don't like walking around with like a couple thousand souls. We can level up, so we'll put that into vigor. All right, um, that lion doesn't respond, does he? Thank Christ, thank Christ. All right, we still have a little bit more to do. We didn't go this way. All right, there's a ballista. We need to address that. I wanted to attack again, but thanks, game. Appreciate that. Or did somebody use the ballista? Alright. Another ballista dickhead. Okay, three ballista dickheads.
Bro, how do I get up there? Oh, you're just gonna drop down, that's fine. Alright, uh, what we really want to go to, boys, is, uh, over here. Wait, a sight of grace? Oh, we're at the very beginning of the castle now. Well, we're at least close to it. Yeah, no, we're right at the beginning. We open the gate. The open ring device is probably up here. Wait a second. This guy has to die. Yeah, you thought you could put your weapon away. Not wrong. Oh, that's that's how you do it. The giant lever. We did it. Commoner simple garb. Goodbye, friends. Thank you for your help. Yep, and that's the uh that's the entrance, so And there are, I think our NPC friend was down there. Wish I could see a more detailed map of the castle. Unless this is it. Still feel like there's some stuff I missed. Yeah, I want to go here. I want to go to the Rampart Tower. I want to go to the Rampart Tower. Then we we need to go back to the. Uh, place part of me feels like I can make that jump and I can You're like what is that like how do I how am I supposed to get down there I guess maybe uh oh no it's an explosive one okay literally the worst enemies in the game I'll say it I'll say it over and over again Dozing cross-legged. All that for a gesture, huh? Okay. Wait, I can just go here. Oh, I think this is where those two buddies fucking murked the shit out of me. Buddy! I need to go down and check this out, though. First and foremost. More somber smithing stone. Oh, there's the grafted MF. Maybe we take him on. Scooby Doo shit here. It's like tiptoe behind the guy. Ah, oh, a lump of flesh. What the? F what? All right, you're one HP. Golden rune. What's what we got here? Chrysalid's Memento. Chrysalid's Memento. What's that all about? 
Went to the left by the chrysalid sacrificing sacrifice for grafting. A brooch wrapped in red velvet traces of blood are visible. Faintly visible spirits try to convey something, but their voices cannot be heard. That sucks. Alright, motherfucker. Alright, you're kinda you're kind of uh kinda hit hard. That is a terrifying noise. Oh ho ho! Bro, this thing is insane. He's like one HP away and that's fucking they start busting out fucking all the moves. Alright. Literally took all of my Estus to kill that guy. Alright, later. Alright, that's one thing on my list that I wanted to come back and do is kill that guy. Mission accomplished. Later. Shortcut? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, this takes me back up to this guy. Who is down below. They're still here waiting for me. Alright, goodbye. You wanna go in there too? Alright, we came in from that way. We're gonna go across this way. That's where the dead bodies are. And I want to say that's pretty much everything. I probably missed some things, but... Was there any other areas that I was thinking about going to? Uh, let's warp back. Let's go to the left side chamber. Yeah, we still didn't figure out this. We still didn't figure this door out. Like, there's gotta be a fucking way. And we gotta run.
I wonder what happens when you save and quit in this game. Like, out of curiosity. I'm trying to figure out how to get to that door. I feel like I was on the right path here. I feel like I was on the right path. Because there was like two ways we could have gone. And we dropped down on the right there. I guess we had a, oh yeah. So, oh yeah, this is a, why can't I summon? We just want to get a big fucking swing in at this guy. Why does that do so much damage? Just the whirlwind shit. I, th I think it would just like stun. That much I get, but it does a decent chunk of damage, mate. Guys are no joke. Kind of like Lothric Knights, but like on just a lot of fucking steroids. Like a lot of steroids. Oh, I haven't been using the weapon art of this at all. Which is kind of sick, as you can see. Nomadic Warrior's Cookbook. Fucking cookbooks, dude. Cookbook. Oh, this is the ladder I tried to fucking go up, and my runes are still down there. This is the ladder I got ganked at. That is the ladder of prime gankage. Well, let's head down. Now that I have a flask or two. That's a lot of runes, my brother. Hyper armor is kind of nice. Oh, that's kind of nice. I might need a cerulean flask if this keeps working well. No, yep. Okay, I definitely, I've definitely gone that way. Cause, yeah. All right. I know your buddies right here. Oh shit, he did some fire breathing shit! He did some fire breathing shit! What was that? guys are tough, dude. Okay. I was lucky he just didn't follow up like they always do. When they follow up, they hit hard. Guy did some cool shit before he died. 
Wait, don't I have some shit that like slowly raises HP over time or FP? Yeah. Alright, cool. I think I already went this way. But I'll just backtrack just to be sure. Oh, I know where I am now. Okay. Alright, I know where I am. That starlight works for a good time. Fully uh, restored my shit and then some. Ah, and of course, these, as soon as I use it to see how long it'll keep going, it stops. All right. It gave us quite a few uses, though, so I can't even complain. Is there a reason to drop down on these guys? I mean, it doesn't look like it. I also don't see a way back up if I do drop down, so I don't, I don't want to do that. It also tells me I can summon while I'm on the ladder, but as soon as I get off the ladder... Oh. Never mind. Castle Storm Val at night time. Kind of a vibe. <sighs> Son of a bitch. No. God damn it. Alright, well. I have 9,800 runes, so once we get out of combat, we're gonna warp somewhere. And I think we're gonna leave this place as is for now. And we're gonna get out of here, because yeah, it's almost been an hour. Still in combat. Just a second, though. I just need to check one thing. I just need to check one thing. Or I missed a jump. I don't even know if, like, there was anything to do once I got on that ledge or that rooftop there. I don't even know. I guess we'll find out momentarily. That beautiful tree up there. I mean, besides to get this item, there's a ramp here. Yeah, I don't think there's anywhere to go once I get on that roof. Yeah, no, you can miss me with the flamethrower shit. And then this drops us down here. Wait, didn't I already use a key? No, wait. I don't have any keys. That guy doesn't respond, does he? I knew I missed something, dude. Alright, um... Alright, so... We want to... Rampart Tower Bonfire, is that the best one? Also, it's called a bonfire. Okay, we're gonna go to the table. I need to buy one of those keys. 
So as you can see, some things have changed. This one guy who's always here is not here anymore. Um, Greetings. Nice to see you again. Stormvale Shack lady's here. I should have told you sooner. Isn't this place impressive, though? The round table hold. Covert quarters of the two fingers. And gathering place of champions who vie to become Elden Lord. I never knew the guidance bestowed upon us tarnished had such fantastic roots. Although, it's all a bit much for me, in truth. I'm still looking for my own purpose. She was the chick in the shack, though, right? I wanted to become grafted. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she was. Those who live in yep, shut up. Should you? Ah, well then, would you? Give a prayer book. That is a work of heresy. Its incantations bear no lineage from the earth tree. Very well. I'll take it off your hands. Please do. I have literally have no use for it. That is a work of heresy. Its incantations. Very well. I'll take it off your hands. What do we got here? Urgent heal. Heal. Cure poison. Magic fortification. Flame fortification. Flame sling. Catch flame. Assassin's approach. Darkness. Rejection. Black flame and black flame blade. Ooh, that's a nice one. May the golden order shine. That's a nice one. Oh yeah, this is the thing I wanted to fucking show you guys. This door is open, and I didn't think it would open. Two fingers. Ew, is that what he meant by two fingers? Like, literal two fingers, bro. What the fuck? Yeah, wow. Um, before I do that... Are you that new tarnished? Yeah, I'm that new tarnished. You've done well. I am Enya, the finger reader. I interpret the words of the fingers. Envoys to the greater will. Look there. The fingers tremble. To welcome you, Shadbear. Let their wisdom wash over you. Great Elden Ring, root of the Golden Order, anchor of all lands, giver of grace, wellspring of all joy. Until it was shattered, the tragic corruption of the Order has taken its toll across the realm. Life lies in ruin, fallen to pieces. Foul curses and misery spread, unabating. But the greater will has not abandoned the realm, nor the life that inhabits it. So it is that the tarnished are guided by grace, called to act. Brave tarnished, your great rune is a handsome shard of the Elden Ring. Seek another of its kind to become the Elden Lord and restore the Golden Order. Let the words of the fingers guide you. Remembrance of gold has found its way into your possession. Debbie gods and even the crater of the champions are hewn by the earth tree upon their end into remembrances. They are valuable indeed. These remembrances yet house the power of their former masters. And should you wish to wield that same power, well, I will lend you the strength of the fingers. Oh, do not recoil from my offer. Whoops. 
Receive power from about great runes. Runes are the stuff of demigods, the children of the Queen Merica, she who is the vessel of the Elden Ring, tainted by the strength. Uh, but none could become Elden Lord, and so grace is extended to kind of the tarnished. Listen, the finger speaks. I'm not going to bother reading it. Godric the Graft, it was but a distant relation, the runt of the litter. His divine blood sorely diluted. Ah, the children tainted by the strength of their runes. Her children warred, but none could become elf, and so grace was lesser. The great room Okay, I was like, wait, is this new dialogue? But it's not. Rapture. Bro, what the fuck actually is this, though? When they said two fingers, I thought it was, like, a metaphor for, like, maybe two people. Um, like, two separate people, but no, it's literally... Whatever the fuck this is. That's just weird, bro. That's like some fever dream shit. Alright, um... That was a nice little bit of lore. Dumped. Okay, um, something that changed. This door was shut... Uh, when I came here when I wasn't recording, but now it's open again, which is strange. You're still the edge lord. This person's new. Oh, hello. I've not seen you here before. I am the Feli Lu, warrior, here by decree of my father. The pleasure's mine. As a fellow Lu, Horalu? Guided by grace to the round table hold. Horalu, chieftain of the Badlands? Ah, oh, yes. I wonder if you've met my foster father. He's in his study. The room enters garden just over there. If you haven't already, I advise you introduce yourself. Father is leader of the round table. I'm sure talking to him will be worth your while. It's about time I headed off. I'll see you again, warrior, should the fate stain it. You've received the wisdom of the two fingers, have you not? Then, just as promised, I bid you welcome. As a true member of the Round Table, I am known as Gideon Ofnir. As a tarnished who wishes to stand before the Elden Ring and become Elden Lord, I am accumulating knowledge to be all-knowing. You now belong to a select group of fellows. As such, I ask that you remain constant. You'll be after more great runes now, eh? Then as your fellow, allow me to divulge a little knowledge. The inheritors of the great runes, the shard bearers. We of the round table know the location of five of them, including the one you defeated. Godric the Grafted, Lord of Stormvale. General Radan, who fought Melania and her rot to a standstill in the Caelid Wilds. Praetor Rykar, Lord of the Volcano Manor of Mount Gelmir. Morgoth, the Grace Given. Veiled Monarch and Lord of Lane Dell. And Renala, Queen of the Full Moon. Ruler of Rhea Lucaria's Academy. You'll still be after more great runes, won't you? Wow, um... <sighs> Sir Gideon Offner, the all-knowing. This is interesting because this is the guy they talk about in the opening cutscene. And maybe, maybe the mis maybe I misinterpreted how that opening cutscene is actually 
like the information you're supposed to get from it. Because maybe those aren't the end quote Lord souls you're supposed to go after. Otherwise, I'd have to kill this guy. I mean, right? This would be one of the bosses, one of the main story bosses that I'd have to be going after. And that obviously doesn't, I mean, to me right now, it doesn't make any sense unless he's just, unless there's a lot of deception uh, here. But because in DS3, they talk about the Abyss Watchers, they talk about Aldrich, Yorm, um, etc., etc. I can't remember the, the fourth one. Aldrich, Yorm, Abyss Watchers. Whatever, it's not important. But, and in DS1, you know, Nido, Seath, uh, Bed of Chaos, Witch of Isleth, whatever. Those are like the big names that you're supposed to go fight. So you kind of view them as the bad. Maybe I just, again, misinterpreted that opening cutscene where they talk about Horolu, Chief from the Badlands. They talk about Sir Gideon Offnir, Fia the Deathbed Companion, which are people, you know, at least Sir Gideon and uh, Fia. These are people we've already met in the Round Table Hold that are people that are just like us trying to become the Elden Lord. Um, so maybe that's just what they were talking about. So, Godric the Grafted, Lord of Stone. Despite being the blood of Godfrey, first Elden Lord, he's a grotesque old fool grasping for power. His castle lies upon the cliff to Limgrave's northwest, but I suspect you know that well enough already. General Radan, the famed Red Lion and Scourge of the Stars, is a ferocious warrior. He fought Melania and her rot to a standstill in the Caled Wilds to Limgrave's east. And now, Caelid has been engulfed by the Scarlet Rot. Even approaching the region is no mean feat. I've heard survivors of Radan's army are still in the wilds, staving off the rot with fire. And if it's true, I suspect Radan is still there as well, in Caelid. Though, I doubt he much resembles his former self anymore. General Radan, he fought... Okay, there's just, just one... Traitor Rikard is the lord of the Volcano Manor on Mount Gelmir. He is a ruthless justicia who commands a company of inquisitors, reviled for his serpentine demeanor. The volcano, Mount Gelmir, lies in the west of the Altus Plateau, the realm of the Erd Tree. It was the stage of the most appalling battle in the entirety of the Shattering. Rikard has committed the grave sin of blasphemy. Marking himself as an enemy never to be forgiven. Morgoth the Grace given is Lord of Landell, the capital city. It lies at the foot of the Erd Tree, in the east of the Altus Plateau. But the Two Fingers forbid us from venturing there, until we've acquired enough great runes to repair the Elden Ring. Set your sights elsewhere for the time being. The Veiled Monarch can wait. Interesting. The Academy of Rhea Lucaria lies to Limgrave's north, towering over the mist-laden lands of Lyernia. Renala is queen of the Carian royals, who govern the Academy. But Renala herself is no demigod. Her beloved Radagon left her to become Queen Marika's second husband. Taking we, we heard about this from the turtle. Sort. The great rune dwells within the amber egg that was Radagon's gift to her. Nefeli. I understand you've been speaking to Nefeli. She's my daughter. I took her in when she lost the guidance of grace. Though a mere axe-wielding barbarian, her youthful credulity suited my purposes. So I put her to work. Do not hesitate to employ her. Should her services benefit you? Despite her looks, she is more than capable in the press of battle. All right. Well, thank you for the fucking heads up. So yeah, that's 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 a little interesting to me. Like, never really looked at it that way. Like now, that makes more sense now because, you know, the the way that cutscene is interpreted. I still want to know who the fuck you are. Maybe she already said, and I wasn't paying attention. Um.
Yeah, you would think that like, oh, those are the Lord Soul bosses. They're getting off near Fia, <clears throat> you know, et cetera, et cetera. But they don't, uh, they don't give it away like they do in DS1's opening cutscene. God damn it, I don't have enough shit. Those words were not meant for you. I may be prisoner to you, tarnished lot. But my prayers are mine. And mine alone. Well, I've had my say. I'll be more careful too. Look at her, you boy here. She's crestfallen and can scarcely swing a blade. But she has a gift. For spirit tuning. I saw another one like her long ago. Their eyes share the same hue. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Yeah, I mean, I'm still, I'm still just a little taken by, back by that uh, this newfound revelation of the the people we're after are not the people that they introduced in the cutscene because that's just how I've been used to, and a lot of people that play Souls games is seeing that you know they talk to you about these powerful beings that you have to go slay in order to, you know, fix what's wrong in the world, I guess. Seath, Nito, Witch of Izalith, uh, Abyss Watchers, Yorm, Lothric, Aldrich. Very interesting stuff, and I think that is going to do it for this episode.